Now, your local weather with the KX Storm Team. 17 after the hour. Welcome back to Good Day Dakota. Yeah, well, a little bit of uh, snow on the way, but not not too terribly much. Nothing that's going to impact our drive this no, morning. No, just a little bit of a light snow today and mm -hmm. maybe a little bit of wind as well. But I do want to start first with a picture of mm -hmm. a group that came in. You know, Tim and I did the noon show yesterday right. and uh, a group from Glen Ellen, Glen Ellen High School stopped by. And we <laughs> just snapped Yeah, we a had a live audience. Yeah, we fun. never have a live audience. <laughs> we usually get clapping from our camera operators every once in a while if we mess up. But uh, these yeah. guys were awesome and they asked a lot of great questions and we want to say hi and good morning to you if you're watching and thank you for coming that was a lot of fun so satellite radar right now a little bit of light snow there in eastern montana again this is uh, moving through the state today a lot of cloud cover out there as well a little more moisture where that comes from you can see this is all part of an alberta clipper that will bring wind it will bring again light snow and then colder temperatures back behind it right now 15 in bismarck 26 there in dickinson 19 in williston and 16 in minot wind speeds are pretty light from the west here 5 to 15 but these are increasing into the afternoon. In fact, here's the wind speed trend into the afternoon. These are sustained wind speeds, not wind gusts. Wind gusts could get as high as, say, 20, 25, possibly some areas up to 30. So it will be a gusty afternoon, but uh, the better part of the morning, we'll say around that 10 to 15 mile per hour range. And then this afternoon, we'll start seeing those sustained wind speeds of around 20, uh, possibly some isolated areas of around 25. So it will be breezy, but it drops off this evening as that clipper does exit and that high pressure moves in a little bit more of a stable air mass here, really clearing us out and dropping those temperatures as well. Very hit or miss light snow today. You got a great chance of actually getting missed today of snow. Uh, a brief cool down back behind it, and then we've got a nice warm up as we head into the weekend. Big pattern shift here that's going to promote sunshine and warmth. Here's the forecast. You can see here it moves through rather quickly. Uh, wind speeds shifting back behind it and becoming a little breezy and gusty, keeping with that really scattered, isolated chance for some flurries into the evening. This is 10 p.m. tonight, so this is out of here tonight. And then high pressure slips in behind it. This is what's going to cool us down. Some single digits to around 10 degrees will decrease the cloud cover through Thursday and we'll get a sunny afternoon highs tomorrow a little chilly back behind this uh, Alberta Clipper but here's the, one of my snow forecast models you can see kind of the hit or miss nature that, it, that it'll uh, bring and it's going to give us maybe a, a trace to up to a half an inch of accumulation this is not going to be a high accumulation event uh, but it is going to bring that colder temperature uh, forecast back behind it temperatures today 20s for most of us maybe some upper teens there around Harvey but we're looking at a cool down tonight there are those single digits I was telling you about down to zero in Harvey and some of the higher elevations up towards the Turtle Mountains could even see some sub zero overnight lows. So Thursday morning bundle up heading to the bus stop uh, highs tomorrow. Well, they'll rebound a bit, but not as much as they have been teens to around 20 again that decrease in cloud cover, but we do rebound for the weekend. 20s on Friday, sunshine, 20s and 30s through the weekend. This is Minot Williston, and then we start off next week above freezing for a lot of us. Here is Bismarck and Dickinson again, starting to warm and then keeping with that warmth through a good part of next week. Notice there aren't a lot of precipitation icons on this seven day either. We've got a dry uh, kind of pattern setting up as well. Yeah, you know, 20s and 30s, that's really mm -hmm. not so bad Not at all. bad in the middle of December. I guess we're kind of in the middle of December by next week, right? right. Or this exactly. weekend. Exactly. Yeah. Tom's Already. Oh, by. my gosh. Yeah. Good looking forward. That's so much to do. <laughs> I know. Okay. Yeah. Thanks, Amber. <laughs> Keep it with us on Good Day Dakota. Still ahead. Trying to send your packages.